How do you do a screen recording on a Mac? Well, we're about to find out, so let's get in it. All right, what you're gonna wanna do first is navigate to your QuickTime player. If you don't know where that's at, find it in your apps. It is a black square with a gray Q, and it has blue hue inside of it, dude. So go ahead and left click on it, boom, it'll open. How do you know it's open? Well, there's nothing that pops up, except there is a gray dot underneath the icon. That means it's open. So now what you're gonna wanna do is right click, booyah, and then go to new screen recording. All right, click on new screen recording, boom. Now your, mer your cursor has now turned into a little itty bitty camera. Tiny itty bitty camera that moves all around the screen. Now, if you look on the bar that has popped up on your screen, you can see different options. I like to keep it just on record and the entire screen. Next, what's very, very important is a lot of times um, I have done screen recordings and I wanted the audio but did not capture it. So, click on options, boom, and then you will see microphone down there towards the bottom half. Uh, microphone, there's none, and then should pop up as your MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, MacBook, whatever you're using. And go ahead and click on your MacBook. Do not leave it on none, because none, there will be no audio. So I have it clicked on MacBook Pro for me. Then you can hit record, or you can simply click anywhere on the screen. Boom, booyah, it's recording. But how do I know it's recording? I don't know. Actually, I do know. So what you wanna do is look up on the right top area of your screen where you see the Wi-Fi, the battery, Bluetooth, all that, you will see a white circle, white kirkle with a square right in the middle, a black square. That is an indicator that your screen recording is recording and audio is recording from the speakers in your MacBook. Now, whenever you're done, just go ahead and click on it. Click on that white kirkle with a black square. Boom, bah! Now you have your video popped up on your screen and it's done, except um, for where you want to export and save it. So now it looks like your screen because you recorded the entire screen, right? So it gets a little confusing, but go to the file, not on the video, but on your computer, go to file, boom, booyah, export as, and you can do 4K, 1080, 720, I would recommend 1080 is kind of the standard. Um, it's not too big, not too small of a file. And QuickTime does a very good um, job of keeping the resolution but making the file size very small, which I like. So just click on, boom, 1080 right there. Booyah. And then go ahead and name it. Save it where you want. It will save and export. It does take a few minutes to export. Um, and then you can now watch the video that you screen recorded on your Mac. What? If you found this video helpful or useful, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. Please, I appreciate that so much. If you have any questions, go ahead and put them in the comments down below and I will answer them as soon as I can. I appreciate you guys' time. Have a good day. Peace.